guys, we are on the highway again today and we're heading to Kamloops, BC and we're just outside of Clinton, BC where we spent the night and it's changed, the landscape has dramatically changed from, you know, lots of alpine forest trees to deserty, which is so weird. Brian was just saying how on him and uh, his good friend Matt Ray were driving through this area like 10 plus years ago or 12 years ago. They thought it was so strange that there's a desert here, right? That's right. That's Very right. Weird. It's so strange. We're in Canada and there's a desert landscape. A high desert landscape, not like cactus or anything yet that we've seen. But they have the sage brush and everything. So it's really neat. Definitely, uh, I wasn't expecting this, although Brian had told me about it. So it's really cool to see it though. And we're going to Kamloops today and we're going to spend two nights there. First time we're spending two nights in a while since we've been uh, just trying to head out of Alaska and get further south and everything. But today we're heading uh, east so to check out the city of Kamloops. So we'll show you more along the way. I think we're going to stop at a winery today because uh, there's some BC wines that are really um, well known it says or it seems. There's even a BC wine trail, which I didn't know about, so it's pretty cool. We're hopefully gonna check out one and we'll show you if we do. Otherwise, it's beautiful out on this Sunday morning drive. We're super excited, yay! Look at all those, look at all that, that's so cool. So neat. All right, more to come later today. Hey guys, today we are on our way to Kamloops and we had to stop in this town of Savona. Now in Julie's previous video just a second ago, she was so surprised and so was I that you have a deserty landscape like this in British Columbia or in Canada in general. This looks like something out of northern New Mexico. But we're here in Savona at this uh, provincial park at this lake. It is a beautiful day. It's like 79 degrees, it's sunny, it's been raining, it's deserty, this lake is here. And it's Sunday, so everyone's out having a good time, and so are we. So we're about 30 miles from Kamloops, but we just had to stop, check out this lake in this area, because it's so cool, and it's so different than what you would expect from Canada. But here we are, in Southern British Columbia, in Savona, BC. Hey guys, welcome to a beautiful Monday morning here in Kamloops, BC. Right now we're at MacArthur Island Park, which is right almost in the middle of the city, but it's right in the middle of the river too. And it's called the tournament capital of Canada here because of this weather. Hockey, baseball, basketball, football, everything. They have tons of tournaments here, so that's why they call that here in the city. Also, the crazy thing is, as I'm sure you know now, Kamloops is a desert city, but right here, as you see behind me, these beautiful fields, but then right behind them, you have all the desert mountains. So this is almost the best of both worlds here. This is like Albuquerque, this is kind of Denver, but this is Canada, so it's pretty cool. It's a booming city, we're having a good time. We're just biking around today before we go check out the downtown. Because it's supposed to be, if you can believe it, almost 90 degrees here in this city, which is pretty insane. We're about three hours north of the U.S. border, but it's the desert, so what are you going to do? But we're here in Kamloops, so here we go. MacArthur Island Park in downtown Kamloops. <laughs> Hey guys, we are looking at the Thompson River here in Kamloops. It's a beautiful view from MacArthur Island Park of the river and we just wanted to show it to you guys. There's lots of beaches here along this river. It's really neat. Yesterday when we were driving in, we saw lots of people on the beach, but since it's Monday, no one's really here, but still a really beautiful scene with the desert landscape and the river. Thompson River. Hey guys, we are looking at a yellow-bellied marmot. There's lots of them here on this island. 
There's another one right over here. Right there. All right, uh, right there. And there's another one there. And we've been seeing them all over the island while we've been biking. So this is really cool. They seem to really like people. This woman was just feeding one. So, really uh, need to see. Oh, no, he's lying down over there. <laughs> Very cute. Hey guys, we are here in downtown Kamloops today, walking around this downtown area. It's about uh, two long streets and like probably six or seven blocks or so. So we're just walking around here all day today and it's uh, right along the Thompson River too, or just a block over that way is that the Thompson River. So we're walking around enjoying ourselves and if you can hear in the background that is CBC Radio. We're right next to the radio station so this is the live broadcast happening right now. So we just wanted to show you where we're at in downtown. It's beautiful here. Brian just said it's the perfect mix of everything he would need in a city. It's desert but there's trees and it's just a really cool city with everything that a bigger city would have to offer. So really nice. We love it here and we'll show you everything we find along the way. We're now in Kamloops Riverfront City Park. Uh, behind me is a banner we think from a busker fest that was going on yesterday. But this park is really cool. It's right on the Thompson River and there's a beach going on. Even though it's Monday, kids are out of school so it's pretty hopping right now. And behind Julie is a little free water park as well and park lands all around it. So as she turns you're going to see all this. We just went down, there's actually a beach with a lifeguard and kids swimming in the river. So we went down there, it's a little chilly but it's 90 degrees out if you can believe that. So uh, we stuck our feet in and it feels pretty good today. But here we are right now, Riverside Parks in downtown Kamloops.